and liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket. The Atlas V RD-180 engine ignites and generates 3.83 mega or 860,200 pounds of thrust to lift the rocket away from the pad. Shortly after liftoff, Atlas begins a pitch over to attain the proper flight path while minimizing the pressure the vehicle experiences during flight. Within the first couple minutes of flight, the Atlas V reaches Mach 1, the speed of sound. Approaching payload fairing jettison, the Atlas V is burning propellant at a rate of 719 kilograms or 1,585 pounds per second, traveling more than 9,500 kilometers or 5,900 miles per hour, and located 112 kilometers or 69 miles in altitude and 116 kilometers or 72 miles downrange. During ascent, the X-37B orbital test vehicle is protected inside a 5-meter diameter payload fairing. This two-piece shell encapsulates both the Centaur upper stage and the X-37B. Once the vehicle is climbed above the densest part of Earth's atmosphere, the payload fairing is jettisoned. Following jettison of the payload fairing, propellant levels deplete and the booster engine shuts down. Following booster engine cutoff, the Atlas Centaur separation system activates to release the booster stage. The vehicle now weighs a little more than 15% of what it did at liftoff. The Centaur main engine is then started to begin second stage flight. Following main engine start, Centaur continues on to deliver the X-37B to begin its classified mission. 